Hello friends, welcome to Simple Makeatronics. While learning Arduino, the 8th step is interfacing Nokia 5110 LCD display. This is 1.5 inch Nokia 5110 LCD display. It has 48 by 84 pixel resolution with 504 bytes of memory storage. These are the pinouts. Two for power supply, one for data input, one for clock input, three for control, and one for backlight. The pinouts are marked on the back side of the Nokia 5110 also. Similarly, the pinouts in short are marked on the front side of the Nokia 5110. Now, we will connect Nokia 5110 to Arduino Nano using breadboard. Now, connect the 3.3 volts pin and ground pin of Arduino to VCC and ground pins of Nokia 5110. This is the circuit diagram to interface Nokia 5110 with Arduino Nano. The 10 kilo ohms resistors are used here to protect 3.3 volts signal pins of Nokia 5110 from 5 volts signal pins of Arduino. The ground pins are connected. Then, VCC pin is connected to 3.3 volts pin and the backlight pin is connected through a resistor. This is 3.3 volts line to VCC and to backlight through 330 ohms. This is ground line. Now, the power supply to Nokia 5110 is ready. Now, the 10K resistors are used for signal lines. Now, the Arduino Nano is to be programmed through its micro USB port. When the USB cable is connected to your desktop or laptop, the four background LEDs glow, as seen here. Open Arduino IDE and load the Nokia 5110.ino sketch. The sketch uses Nokia 5110.cpp, which has code required to control the Nokia 5110 display. The text fonts are defined separately in lcdfont.h file. Now, check the port connection in Tools menu. Then, compile and upload the sketch to Arduino Nano. The display shows the logo in normal mode and inverted mode. Then, lines and a circle. Then, text message in normal direction and inverted direction. Then, draws rectangles around the text. Then, color inversion. Then, sliding the screen sideways and vertically, with or without screen rotation. When we disconnect the backlight resistor, the four LEDs stop glowing. Still, the display works. We are able to view the contents on the Nokia 5110 display as earlier. Hope you enjoyed the video. For source code, send contact form through our website www.simplemechatronics.com. Also subscribe to this channel for more video notifications in future. Please press like button if you like this video. Subscribe Simple Makeatronics for access to more projects. And share with your friends about Simple Makeatronics. Thanks for watching the video. More explanation and circuits are available at Simple Makeatronics website. Links for other projects are available at description below. Bye friends, see you in the next video.